I'm going to show you how to set up your wheel for throwing. Um, so first thing I want to do is I want to get my splash pans on that look like this. So I'm going to take my big splash pan. See this little circle that's cut out? There is a metal rim underneath this uh, wheel head right here. And what you're going to do is you're going to take this pan, the big one, and you're going to tilt it down and you're going to tilt it underneath. And it should be kind of difficult to get in there. You know you're doing it right. And you gotta pull it on to your wheel like that. Next I'm gonna get my smaller pan that looks like this. And it should slide on pretty easily. And there are little notches for you to connect them. So after I've gotten that part of my wheel ready, I'm gonna sit down at the wheel. I like to use a towel over my lap because it gets so messy. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm gonna put a bat, B-A-T, on my wheel. So there are little, um, little screws right here to connect these. And you wanna use the rough side facing up. This slick side is supposed to be facing down. So I'm just gonna slide that on. All right, next thing I wanna do is make sure my wheel is on. So if you are right-handed, you want your wheel to be spinning counterclockwise. If you're left-handed, you're going to hit these little arrows over here and, and it should go the other way. So I'm right-handed, so I'm gonna keep going counterclockwise. Um, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start just throwing a cylinder. So I have a couple things. I have a couple uh, pieces of clay already wedge about a baseball size, about a pound of clay, and I just have them ready and to the side. So I want a couple because you're probably not going to, uh, you're going to need them so you can throw a little bit faster without having to take a break in between to get new clay. Other things I'm going to need is I'm going to need um, a bucket of water like this um, with a small sponge. I'm going to need my needle tool, uh, this wooden pointy tool, a metal rib, and sometimes a blue rib is nice and handy, and then also a wire tool um, later on to cut it off the bat. 